Okay, here's the deal. Scott is a literal saint. I knew he was an amazing man when I married him, but I had no idea how much of an amazing father, husband, provider he would be for this family. He works so hard during the day, and then he comes home ready to help with Maisie, ready to clean up, cook dinner, things that I thought I would be able to get done as a stay-at-home mom, but I am realizing there is no time for anything except keeping Maisie alive. Today, I really wanted to do something nice for him. I know it's really not much, but I'm hoping that I can have the whole apartment cleaned and have dinner on the table when he gets home. I really want him to know that his constant understanding and patience as I kind of navigate what being a new mom is has not gone unnoticed. Plus, I have just kind of been a crazy ball of hormones the last couple days, and I can't imagine that that's been very fun to deal with. So when Maisie wakes up from her nap, we're gonna head to the grocery store and get everything we need to make Scott's favorite meal. Also, in case you haven't noticed from the mirror back there, I am sitting on the ground with the camera on Maisie's rocking chair. I tried to start this vlog holding the camera, and after about 10 seconds, my arm hurt real bad, so I probably need to start going to the gym again. Just a note, if you have a baby, I would recommend not living on the second floor, because it makes getting down a lot more challenging. I'm coming for you, Maisie. Hi. Um, I wanted to wear a sweater today because like it's December and I wanted to feel like, you know, it's winter, but I am actually sweating. Vlogging while pushing a stroller is really difficult, so this isn't happening. We made it. All in favor of me buying this stocking for Scott. All right, we got everything and hopefully Maisie doesn't cry too hard on the way home and I can put her down and then I can make the food. Maisie has the incredible ability to fall asleep like a minute before we get home. And then it's so hard because she wakes up and then it's even harder to put her down for her nap. I never know if I should just let her sleep in her car seat or take her out and put her in the bassinet. And yes, I am out of breath from carrying the stroller and car seat and groceries up the stairs. Moving her probably was not the right decision. I just feel better with her laying down, but maybe I should just keep her in the car seat so she sleeps because as you can hear, she's not sleeping. Not looking good for my plan of getting stuff done while Maisie sleeps. Maisie is up and fed and happy, so I'm gonna give her a little bit of tummy time before I put her in her little bouncy seat and bring her in the kitchen with me because I don't wanna risk making the dinner on her next nap in case she doesn't nap. Can you roll over, sweetie? You're so close. How do you feel that we finally got it recorded that you can roll? Say, take that, Grandpa. I know you didn't believe that I could roll, but watch that, I did. And you can make so many cool faces. Okay, so Scott's favorite food is cheeseburgers, but when we make those, he makes those because he's a much better griller than I am. But one of his favorite meals is something called chicken pillows. Um, I used to make this all the time for him and his friends while we were dating. It's pretty easy and not very healthy, so please no judgments. You melt cream cheese and butter together, pour that in chicken, and then wrap them in crescent rolls, and then dip that in an egg and rub it in saltines. And I have my little helper here. I am obsessed with these tights. They're still a little too big but hopefully she'll fit into them soon. Ta-da! Look who's home! Dad's home from work! <laughs> Airplane to the kitchen! You good at holding your neck up? Good job, sweetie. Can you grab some snacks with me? What? <laughs> when did you make those? Surprise! How'd you do that? Maisie and I made you dinner! <laughs> Yay! Thank you, girl! And I'm making a video all day about surprising you at dinner because you really deserve it because you're such a hard worker and I wanted to do something nice for you. But yeah, we're gonna pop those in the oven and then have a little dinner as a family. So thanks for watching today, guys. Um, I know what you're thinking. That was way too much Cassie in a video, not enough Scott. So the next time, there'll be more Scott, I promise. Hopefully there was a lot of Maisie. <laughs> yes, there was. Bye!